Hi, Pyropus. Oh, that's a shame. What happened? Sorry to hear that. Oh, drama with the parents is hard, you know. You want to have your own space. Mom? All day, Mom. Every day, Mom. What are you up to today? Well, Greg and Angus and B are going to a party, so I might go out with them. Party, huh? Well, look at you. Back two days and already the social butterfly. Yeah, I'm in pretty high demand. Uh, are you keeping in touch with any of your friends from college? Um, I didn't really make any friends. Not even your remake. Not that nice girl you met at orientation. Yeah, not not really. Okay, well, you go, go out there and you have a nice time, honey. I will. See you later. Yeah, that, that sounds like a crisis, Pyropus. I hope things improve. Still haven't found out why she left school, but I'm guessing it's uh, mental health related or something. Hey, what's it like being back? Well, I just got home, so just like taking it all in. You know, like anything's changed? Yeah, totally. Parkstone's gone, got a snock falcon now, food donkey's gone, got a hand panther though. Harleys are bigger now, saw them running around before. Yeah, I babysit those little shits sometime. Are they bad? They seem so nice. Meh, that's how they fool ya. You know they steal things? What? They steal things. Holy crap, I was fooled. Uh, Adam, uh, basically we're playing May. Uh, she's come back to her, uh, uh, hometown. She dropped out of college. And, uh, so her hometown is sort of, a It's a mining town that's, uh, the mine closed. So everybody's fallen on hard times. We're not sure why she dropped out of college, but uh, uh, they came back and there have been people disappearing from the town. Um, and a skeletal arm was found. So there's something weird going on here, but uh, yeah, mostly we're just kind of catching up with old friends and... Hey guys, guys, stop this! Oh, this is a stoplight fight all over again. Yeah, I remember who won that one. Can we move on? Fine. Fine. Hey, Mr. Chazikov. 
Hello, May, my best worst student. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like the constellations hated school. Hey, don't lock, knock school. School is vital for your future. What are you doing back in Possum Springs? Yeah, I, I dropped out of school. Oh. Well, if you're still interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should have my new telescope set up by then. Sure thing. I can legally shoot you for being up here, you know? <laughs> Cute, never. I used to babysit your cat. Eh. Yeah, this, this feels like some of the towns you'd see in, like, I, I, you know, you ever driven through West Virginia? Just kind of... We see more missing posters here. So something spooky's going on. I know that much. And we're getting on the board's cold comfort. I'm always on the edge. You maybe see someone to talk about this? Hey, Dr. Hank. Ugh. Dr. Hank does everything and nothing. He fixed my leg last year. Yeah, he's treated my babies through sh chicken pox and strep. Uh, I know, I just... whatever. Yeah, Bill, write it up as on the clock. She's not gonna like that. I don't care if she doesn't like it. It was her fault, plain and simple. That is time extra. We charge for that. Uh, all right. Hey, B. Hi. How's work? Stressful. End of the month coming up. And I have to start ordering in winter stuff. B is mad at us, but we don't know why. She, she doesn't like us right now. Which means I have to bribe one or hopefully two of the guys to unload the trucks. Because I am not carrying in a truck full of rock salt by myself. Huh. What do you want? Well, Greg asked me to ask you if you would drive us to the party tonight. You know, the one up in State Park. Yeah, thanks for clarifying. Otherwise, I might have been confused. As to which of the dozens of parties going down on any given night in Possum Springs you are referring to. Are you being sarcastic? I'll drive. Great, thanks. We'll be at your house at 8.30. Be ready or we'll go without you. Okay. Don't get lost on your way home. Hey, I know where I live. No, seriously. Go home and get ready. All right, all right, jeez. We haven't seen Bee's family. I wonder if something happened to him. Hey, mate. How's the laptop running? Really good, thanks so much. Glad to be of service. So, like, yeah. Who rents movies anymore? Hmm, more people than you think. Older people who don't know any better. Kids who for some reason can't get something. Do you ever want to tell them? What, about the internet? About rental by mail? Yeah. Nay, it's not my job to save them. I'm paid to stand here and assist when needed. Take the money, and not openly judge them. So Greg is um, one of our bandmates. Hey there. Uh, hey, who are you? Wax. Oh, okay. Hello. What are you? Oh wait, there's a sign. Navy, huh? Yes, ma'am. You ever consider a future in the Navy? Like, you mean boats? It's a lot more than that, but yes, there are boats. 
Can I drive a submarine? Potentially. Yeah, I can do that on my own. Later. You know, I, I don't want to intrude. But if you're someone who's maybe lacking a bit of direction, that's what brings a lot of folks to the Navy. Yeah, I, I have lots of direction. Like, I'm going to go hang out with friends. Play bass, video games, go to sleep. Etc. I guess I'm adding drive a submarine to the list somewhere. Well, just say. I'm going to go now. Alright, have a good one. Smeltus! Smeltus coming for you! Yeah, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? Party! Party, party! Jeez, dude, you are excited about this party. Ah, you're gonna be there, and that's awesome! God, what a great week it's been. You're home! I'm home! My arms are tired! I expected more mini games and stuff to do in this game, but it doesn't seem like there's a lot going on. Hey, teens! Hey. What are you guys doing? Nothing. Cool! Hey, kids. Hey, doll. Well, I was, you know, your age only a few years ago. Uh huh. Well, see you later. Puss, do you know anything about this game? This is my first time playing through it. me. What? I was just stopping by to see how you were doing. Why? Eh, after the other night, I mean. Why wouldn't I be fine? May, a lot of things that happen around here. Sometimes in town, sometimes out by the stacks, sometimes up in the hill. What? My job to make sure folks like you never see something like what you saw the other night. Folks like you? You're a kid, May, and you're naive, and in its own stupid way, that's beautiful. But the world isn't. And the world isn't out there somewhere. It's here. Alright, are you going to arrest me or something? Because I have a party to go to. Watch yourself, May. I really hate to see something bad happen to you. And being in the wrong place at the wrong time is all it takes. That's all I'm saying. That's ominous. Good night, May. Yeah, didn't, didn't one of the people who worked on this game commit suicide, Pyropus? Thought. Aunt Malkop is planning to kill me. A cab. How do you draw a space dragon? <laughs> Greg rules, okay. Gregory's Pizza Scale. Fancy pizza. Too fancy. <laughs> Bad pet pizza. Uneatable. Avoid. Everything between good as hell. <laughs> the arm. Had a tattoo on it. Chopped or severed. Army jacket. On sidewalk. Angus. Angus is Greg's boyfriend, I think.
Hey, sweetie. Look who's home. Hey, the parents. I made tacos. Excuse me. We made tacos. 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 Do you want tacos? I want tacos. Every day. All day. Now ah, the family that tacos together, rocos together. Honey, no. What? I am so angry at you right now. You've all turned against me. May, honey, do you want sour cream on your taco? I want everything! Okay, okay, okay. Let's go time. Ugh, I should probably make sure I don't look like a cave beast. Eh, looking alright. God, this shirt really accentuates my roundness, doesn't it? I have the worst face. I have a nightmare face. I think the round zero doesn't help. It's cool, dude. Round is okay. I'm being body positive, like the internet said. I'm a real live person, and no one can prove I'm not. You can do this. People like you. You don't like people, clearly. Just because that online test said that your best chance of being happy is a situation where everyone already likes you, but they mostly leave you alone, except when they're delivering food to you. That doesn't mean you can hide in your room and wait for that to happen. That's how hermits are made, May. And they die alone in the middle of winter, waiting for pizza from friends they don't want to see. Alright, what are you going to say? You're a smooth talker? You're a smoothie? Hi, I'm May. I dropped out of college earlier this week. And now I'm in the, living in the woods. Drinking! Jeez, this is yet another road to Hermitdom. This is hopeless. Wheel me out to the curb for garbage day. Oh, jeez, they'll be here any moment. Good luck, kid. I don't need luck. I make my own luck. With a luck machine. Does May hear voices in her head? Is that... Is she schizophrenic, or...? Have disassociative disorder or something? Hey, May, I think Cole will be there tonight. What? Oh my god. Who's Cole? Oh, you remember him? He was in the yearbook with us. Oh, Cole. Yeah, I remember him. May and him were a thing for a while. Really? Wow. He was really smart. Hey, I'm really smart. Yeah, you are, dude. Well, that's so. Ugh, that was awful. I hate beer. I can't remember the last time I drank beer. It's not a delicious drink at all. You take that back! I wish I could still drink beer. I don't know if I should have another drink right now. What? Nothing. Cool party. Yeah. Oh god, it's... Hey, dudes! You see Cole's here? Oh, God. Yeah, you okay? Yeah, yeah, totally fine. You gonna talk to him? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, man! You sure, May? Yeah, I mean, why should I be so weird about it? Well, I mean, you did write that song afterwards. What was it called? To Get Dead, Angel Face. Ugh! We don't need to talk about Go Get Dead Angel Face. Oh god, it's... Maybe I need another drink. I mean, I don't think people with disassociative disorder actually talk to their other personality, do they? I guess beer is just one of those horrible things adults do. Like doing taxes and having babies.
Yo! What? You're kind of grouchy, you know that? No, I didn't. Rude! Oh, depersonalization. Okay, yeah. Hey! May, is that you? Wow. How are you? Well, uh, earlier this week I dropped out of school, and now I'm drinking in the woods. Wow. Okay. What the hell is your problem? What? Be cool, May. Go get a drink and be cool. Ah! Well, how'd it go? Ah! Problem. Sometimes I think I just don't like people. Yeah, man. F the world! Yeah. F it. God, someone really should just F the world already. The world has gone on F for too long! F and right. Screw it, I'm doing two beers. I'm doing beer. And I still taste tacos, okay? What? Nothing. Hey, B. Yeah. Oh, God, you're drunk already. Yeah, that's why we came out here, right? Not really. I have to drive. And even if I didn't, well, I don't have my license. So woohoo for me! Yeah, remember me, Borowski? Oh, God. I don't know if I can do this. Hey, Greg. Whoa, dude, are you okay? Hey, Greg. Did you know I think you and Angie? Angie? That is so cute! I did know that, dude. Well, good. Hey, Angie. My dad knows your dad. They used to work together back in the 80s. Okay. He used to hang out at the bar with your daddy. Dude, don't ever say daddy again. Psst. What? My dad had to stop drinking because he was a danger to me and my mom. <laughs> Dude. Okay, May, you're not allowed to drink anymore. Ever. May, you're drunk. You need to go chill by the fire. I'm gonna go run around naked in the woods! Go sit now. Uh, hey, May. Hey, Coolio! Well, haven't heard that in forever. It's been like three years. That's not long at all. Well, it's good to see ya. I I'm just back for a couple days from school and... Eh, shut up already. But Girl at the video store is all like, Woo, cute boys! And you're a cute boy, Cole. Oh, thanks, May. I, uh, like... Uh, but I hate cute people. Cute is the worst. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. It's not my fault I'm a total trash fire. I got nightmare eyes. And the last thing you see is my eyes outside the window. And then I stab you with my knife. Stab, stab, stab. Boom, dead. And the police get there, you're all like, Nightmare eyes. Hey, new nickname. So don't F with me, kid. F the world. Okay, mate, you're threatening people now. No, B, this is me being body positive. Read the internet. May, I think you need to. F college! Yeah! And those rich kids and the hot people and all writing sex and having papers with each other? Close enough. And that damn statue pointing at me every day. It's supposed to be the founder, but just shapes. I, I'm a total trash mammal. And nothing is ever going to work out. We never had a chance here. But I can't go anywhere else. I'm home again. And I could do something besides sleep. Cry alone. Because things 
Like, just things here, you know? Oh, God. I'm so sick to death. Does that make sense, Colio? Man, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset you, but I, I think you're really great. Home again! Woo! Oh! Tacos. Yeah, this is going well, isn't it? If you puke in this car, so help me. I owe you an apology, B. I'm sorry, I don't even know what happened. You got sloppy ass drunk after what, three cups of watered down beer? Remember when we used to be best friends? We used to be best friends, and B and I still love you, B. I didn't get a word of that. Remember you used to call me Mayday? I called you BB. Oh, you mean when we were like 10? No, I don't. Remember when we were scouts together? And we caught that turtle? Yeah, Foxy the turtle. He died. I feel like you're mad at me all the time. Why is so mad all the time? Ugh. Uh, if I poke puke in her, your parents are gonna be mad at me. Tell your mom I'm sorry, okay? She's so nice. God damn it, May. What? My mother's dead. Huh? She died of cancer. Senior year. Oh, she was so nice. Are you okay? How do you not know this? Did you forget about my dead mom? That was a terrible... I don't, like, remember anything sometimes. I don't take it personally. What happened to you? You used to be smart. You used to be cool. You used to be worth talking to. Why did you even come back? Did college not work out for you? Was it inconvenient? Were you not in the mood? Or killed for that. Still would. I'd kick you out of this moving car right now if then I could go to college. We're here. Get the hell out of my car. <laughs> oh god, let me help you in. There you go. Sorry, B, I'm a mess. You know what? Whatever. It's not your fault. You're just a kid. I'm older than you. Two months. Yeah, well, I stayed here and got older while you went off and stayed the same. <sighs> Good night, matey. Speaking of, as someone who dropped out of college because of mental illness, I can relate.
Part 2, Weird Autumn. Um, I don't know, Adam. I'm not sure. They mentioned early on that uh, at one point in high school or something, or middle school, she attacked a younger kid with a bat. So, I think it's a flashback of some sort. Well, that was a weird dream. I feel awful. Probably look awful. Ugh. I'm gonna burn this room down. With me in it. Live out my remaining days as a shrieking ghost. Yep. <laughs> Thought. Never drink again or go in public. Blah, 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 blah. Dumb shit. Everything feels bad. Whoa, no, no. No way I'm gonna play that one. Too embarrassing. Can I look in the mirror? It won't let me look in the mirror. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it sounds like, I guess, her dad beat her up a lot when she was a kid because he was, he was an alcoholic. And as a result, she has these, uh, the trauma has left her with some form of mental illness, but I can't identify exactly what kind. Thought, become fire ghost and yell at people. Thought, come back to life, granddad. Did she write down that code? No, she didn't write it down. Floating Island and other stories. Granddad didn't read out of this. He, like, recited it from memory and made stuff up on top of that to get me to sleep when I was a kid. Miss you, dude.
Yeah, that's... I'm guessing so, Pyrofist. Yeah, depersonalizing. It's it's a res like you said yeah it would be a response to her trauma. May yeah, come say hi. Uh, okay. Hey hun, you look like crap. Yep. Rough night. Is it that obvious? No, I was just saying you look like crap because I love you. Thanks. If you want to talk about it. I saw Cole at a party in the woods. From senior year? Yeah, he was home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Kinda? Sorta? I don't know. Well, he's a jerk, hon. No, he's not, or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway, looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out of the town center. Finally. And yeah, they're all done with the Churchill steps and the power lines. Great! Hun, I do not want you up on those things. Mom, I'm 20. Huh. Which means you go to jail for it. They'd never catch me. Your Aunt Molly catches you up on there. There's no telling what she'll do. Did I tell you I saw her yesterday out front? Really? Yeah, she's being all weird and cryptic. I don't know. Everything's fuzzy today. Anyway, it's dangerous. You remember Susie Kushner? Gee, Mom, I sure don't. Definitely never heard this story 1,000 times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Now she can't use adjectives. She lost an entire part of speech. Gee, Mom, that's terrible. See, that's the exact kind of for sentence Susie can't formulate. So what are you up to today? I don't know. Gonna go see what Greg and B are up to. You all gonna do something together? I don't know. I, I don't think they hang out much. Past messing around with our old band equipment. Well, there are only so many hours and so many days in our lives. Is there some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? Friendships are like trees. Uh-huh. You have to water them so they grow. And we each have only so much water. Have you ever watered a tree? No. God does that. Okay, I'm out. See you later, sweetie. F the cops. <laughs> hey, man. Hey, Summers. I see you with a journal the other day. Oh, yeah. Doctor's orders. Yeah. Doctor Hank has me doing one, too. Um, okay. You have anger problems, too? Yeah, I was stealing painkillers from the Ham Panther Pharmacy. Oh, jeez. So, Doctor Hank sees journals as a general cure-all. Is it working for you? Nah. Rehabbing the program, too, though. I've become a very good poet. Wanna hear one? Yeah. My heart is a dankness. When I see you, I feel a thankness. Wow, that's, uh, that's really nice. When I feel a blueness, all I need is a Eunice. That's very romantic. It's about my horse. Oh, we're just friends. Yeah, I've... Hey, Glorious. Uh, I've had a lot of therapists recommend keeping journals, and all it does is make me more depressed. Yeah, I could definitely relate to May and dropping out of college because of mental illness. I remember they threatened to kick me out the one time I cut up my arms real bad. Mr. Chazakov's up on the roof again. Pretty sure he's gonna break his damn neck. I just left on my own, though. It wasn't worth it. Agoraphobia, depression, it's a hell of a thing. Constant panic attacks. <laughs> if he falls through one of the windows, I will not hesitate to take legal action. Who? Yeah, I'm up there on the roof next door. If he falls on that roof through a window, you're gonna have to pick which part of him you're gonna sue. <sighs> Whichever piece is the biggest. Hey, I can hear you, you know. Ah, don't be. I'm, it's been... Almost, uh... I mean, it's been 15 years now. It's in the past.
Let's see here. I guess there's some way to get up on the on the Hmm. There must be some way to get up there, huh? I'm not sure I see it though. Yeah, like I said, Adam, I I, I years of therapy and years of just self-care and taking it day by day. Got a church here, okay. Hey, hon. Hey, Mom. Oh, it's been a while since I was in here. I know, sweetie. Nice to see you in the building, at least. Did you meet the new pastor? Nope. No, she's around here somewhere. Might be outside. She likes to go on walks. Cool, cool. I might bump into her. I just hope things work out for for you, Adam, and for you, Pyropus, and for you, Glorious. I, I've got a pretty stable home life right now, so I'm happy. Pastor K.W. Young. Warm enough at night. Yeah, you know I get by. Well, I'm working on something to help you out. Nah, don't go to any trouble. I'm all right. That's good. Gonna get cold soon, though. I, I can get you some blankets for now. For some reason, we have a lot of blankets. That'd sure be a blessing. Well, we bless best with what we already have too much of, anyways. Yeah, <laughs> and we got blankets. Ha! <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I used to take a uh, daily dose of lorazepam, so <laughs> that should tell you, but uh, not anymore. Sneak in the room. That's kind of funny. Wow, this is so where all this stuff ended up. I remember the spring parade. It was so much fun. Till the year that Mallard P. Blooming Grow snapped his tether and ran over Chris Evans. Then they canceled the parade. Yeah, I'm with you, Glorious. Yeah. Cowards. They couldn't cage Mallard. Mallard needed to be free. And neither ropes nor the poor legs of Chris Evans could hold him back. I wonder what happened to both of them. Oh my god! Mallard! What have they done to you? Mallard, you're pregnant! It's one of those god things. Like when you have a baby because god? Holy crap, you are the cutest little vermin. Who's the best vermin? You are! You look so hungry. Is that why you're, uh, not doing anything? I'll come back with food. Don't die! Mallard forever. Miracle rats. 
It's locked. What the hell? That's a fire hazard. Hey! Hey, it's you. It's me. I'm gonna sit. Legs are killing me. Yeah, it's hype to get up here, right? I'm just getting old. I'm 20 years old. Oh, wow, you're like all the way old. How old are you? 15 in February. I used to hang out here after school. Really? <laughs> Most kids don't come all the way up here. Ah, that's why it's so nice. Better than being at home. Where'd you live? Chestnut Street. Oh, okay, out by the tracks. Yeah, I guess I'm not really town. I'm like, tracks. I live down on Maple. Oh, the rich neighborhood. Um, no. Oh, sorry, I just meant it's nice. Uh, it's okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's okay, calm down. Sorry, I get all weird sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> I'll forgive you if you stop for apologizing. <laughs> okay. Tracks are cool. Haven't been out there in a while. Train shakes my room at night. Yeah, in the winter, I can hear it. One of my favorite noises. But you don't have to wake up with bits of ceiling on you. Good point. Alright, I'm out. It's nice chatting. I'm here most days. Cool, see you later. See ya, killer. Ugh. We got a World War One memorial there, I think. Never been to war. Not like the recruiters don't try, though. Hard. Like ten guys from my high school class went off to army. Not afford college some way or another. How's it going, dude? Got a job here. That's cool. Oh, nice. Actually, I'm lying. It sucks. Oh, jeez. Hey, B. Yo. Sorry about last night. I get woozy on cold medicine, so I don't really know what I expected to happen. Sorry for what I said. You know, I, I don't really remember it much, so what else? Ready for alcohol. New town motto. Band practice later? Yeah. Yeah. I'm amazed at this little thing. We were barely even a band in high school. Nah, it's fun. And I get to hang out with Angus. How'd you even up, end up doing it? Eh, when Casey left town, Angus told me that Greg was really sad. So I volunteered to be their new drummer. Well, drummer. I mean... It's a laptop, B. Sure is, May. Sure is. See you later. I got some work to do. I had no idea there were so many kinds of hammers. And wrenches. And nails. My god, the nails. Hey! Whoa, hey, we got, like, the same shirt, but, like, opposites. Oh, wow, what do you know? What's your shirt from? From? Yeah, is it, is it like a band or something? No, I, I made it in home ec back in high school. I just like the symbol. That's an L symbol, right? Uh, I don't know. What's your shirt mean? Secret symbol of God's Wrestling League. Huh? Whoa, what's that? Backyard wrestling. Whoa, where does it happen? Huh? over the place. Backyards, you know. How do I not know about this? Secret. Because it's illegal, I think. People go to the hospital and stuff. That is awesome. This is awesome. It is awesome. Oh crap, I'm gonna look this up. See you there sometime. Hey, May. Hey, Angus, how's it going? You are like the third person I've seen today. I know you've explained it, but I have zero clue of how this place stays open. Oh, uh, you'd be surprised. Band practice later? Gotta warm up my voice. You growl real good. Thanks. I'm born growler. When I was a baby, I never cried. I just growl. I think I cried non-stop until I was like nine. Then I cried all the time again, starting at like 13. You had a good three years of not crying there. They were really productive years. <laughs> What the? What? No! Possibilities. 
Thank you for 28 wonderful years, Possum Springs. Love, Sal and Jan. Closed. No, 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 no! Possibilities is gone! No more pizza delivery and no more Big Sal! No more special birthdays? This is the worst thing that's happened to this town since the flood that took out... The petting zoo. Thank goodness all the animals swam to safety on the roof of the tire place. Who knew goats were such good swimmers? I'm so freaking depressed right now. How about them smelters? Kicked some blue bear ass last night. Good game, good game. Gonna be a hell of a season, bud. Hey, Jeremy? Jeremy Wharton? No one calls me that. Germ, right? Germ warfare. Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's an okay name. Okay. You were like a year behind me, right? Two years. Uh, so you're fresh out, huh? Nah, I hang out with drags sometimes. We ride bikes. Pretty good at it. Okay. What? I saw a rabbit possum the other day. Really? Where? It was crawling across the road. Hadn't it been hit by a car? Nah, just rabbit. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. Wow. It was like a poem. Okay. Well, look who it is! Yep, live for another day. How are you feeling? I was feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town and I don't know, that helped. Fresh air, or as fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So what's up? Are we gonna head to back bad practice? All right, kids, gotta head out soon. Where are you going? Family stuff. Okay, just for a night. Okay, we doing this? Yeah, let's do this. Wait, I don't know the song, like at all. I barely remember how to play bass. You'll be fine. I completely will not be fine. Zero self-confidence, huh? I just don't know the song. You stupid jerks. That was hard. Pretty good. Yeah, that was okay. Not bad considering I don't know this song. That was pretty loud. Is that good? Loud's fine. You wanna do something tonight? Uh, promise it'll be an improvement on last night. What were you thinking of doing? Um, wanna go to the mall? The mall? Yeah, for Lucent. Fort Lucent, like we did when we were kids. When's the last time you were at the Fort Lucent Mall? I don't know, five years ago? Yeah, uh, what? You know what? Yeah, let's go. Great! Yeah, great. Promise it'll be great. Okay, you sure we're doing this? 
Let me check with Greg real quick. Okie doke. Hey, hey, Duder! Angus sleeping for the night? Yeah, gonna be bored. Or rather, I would be if I didn't have plans. Plans? Crimes. Woo, crimes. You up for some crimes? Uh. Alright, should I go with B or should I go with, uh, Greg? Not really sure which to do. B? Alright. Yeah, I might be checking out with B. Let me check first. Cool! Let me know! Yeah, let's go on. Great. Glad I didn't puke in here. Me too. Maybe I just should never drink again. Or maybe you just take it easy next time. I don't know if I do moderation well. No, I could see that. I think the term is risk-taking behavior. Are you seeing someone about this? Hanging with you is working pretty well tonight. I should be getting paid by the hour. I got gum. I'm gonna turn on the radio now. Old Gods of the Fort Lucen Mall. Fort Lucen! Oh my god. Yep. What the hell happened? Uh, the internet? We had the internet when we used to come here. What happened to the carousel? Sold it, I guess. Who buys a carousel? Nobody comes here. What happened to the bookstore? Also the internet. What happened to the arcade? I'm gonna make a sign that says the internet and hold it up until you're done asking. What happened to internet? And yet Dollar Empire is still here? Yeah, I think this is one thing the internet can't compete with. I used to go in here when I was a kid. You could get an eraser for a dollar. A pencil for a dollar. That actually doesn't sound like a good deal. Oh god, you're right. Oh my god! The Urev is still here. <laughs> yeah, this old thing. I can feel the edginess from here. Just looking in there makes me feel old. We are so gonna do that. There's no way I'm going in. Oh, for God's sake! Holy crap. I'm 14 again. Yeah, pretty nuts in here. Hey, isn't that... Shut. Up. Hey, ladies. Hello, lady! Just so you know, we have 20% off select shirts. Woo, t-shirts! Yep. Thanks a lot. Okay. Catch you later. All right. <laughs> nice. Dead Party Boy stickers in 2017? I think they're back in. Huh, that's cool. I bet you listen to them. Uh, yeah, they're good. Yeah, if you're 30 years old and sad, I'm getting there. Huh. Wow, haven't seen belt buckles in a while. At least not fashionable ones. Mike at the shop has one with a rattlesnake driving a semi-truck. Uh, okay, I'm going to do this. Do what? Cover me. I'm going to grab one. What? No! Shh. You are not doing this. So you're really gonna do this? Shh, be cool. This isn't my first time doing crimes. What other crimes have you done? Shoplifting, vandalism, piracy, shoplifting again now. Hey, anyway, why just do the easy crimes? How is this stupid idea easy? Our eyes evolved to notice movement. Like dinosaurs. The dinosaur's moving. Wait, that's a, never mind. So as long as you're perfectly still when the clerk is watching, like you're gonna freeze when she got the books over even if you're in the middle of putting it in your pocket. And this is going to work because dinosaurs, just like dinosaurs, I'm going to pretend you did not know you until you're done, okay? Ma'am, can I help you? <laughs> no, I'm fine.
Do you need to look at something? Uh, no, I'm looking just fine. You look like you use a fine hand. Ah, I hope everything's good. Wouldn't something like that have an RFID tag? <laughs> okay, are you done? Oh yeah! Shut up, let's get out of here. Oh yeah, sweet belt buckle. I am never ever gonna wear. Rubs against my stomach. This is bad, man. You should steal something now. Pardon? Haven't you ever done, like, any crimes? I mean, yeah, I guess. Hasn't everyone? Well, back in there, champ. What? No. Beatrice, let me lay this out. Number one, security cameras aren't even on in there. Number two, cashier clearly isn't paying attention. And number three, there's not one mall cap here as near as I can tell. I don't know. I mean... B, this is an experience. Have it. I'll run interference. Okay, but I'm blaming you and driving away if I get caught. Perfect. All right, I'm going to run interference while you do your thing. What do you mean? I'm going to strike a curse. Clerk, I can do this. Okay, I'll admit that drawing attention is a talent you have. I'm great at crimes. But what if I get caught? You won't. I'll just start screaming if I have to. How's that a good idea? Let's go. Okay, but if this goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Join the club. Hey. Uh-huh. I got a question. T-shirts are 20% off. Yeah, I saw. I was wondering about something else. Okay. The name of the store. Yeah. Uh, you probably get this question a lot. Try me. So is it like you revolution or like your revolution? You know, no one's ever asked this, but I think about that all the time. I bet. God. You know what the other official business name on our checks is? You revolution radical youth culture uprising Inc. That's really dumb. Oh God, I know. Like guys, can't we just be a store that sells cool shit to teens? Yeah, teens go nuts for this shit. The employee discount's also pretty great. I had a job once. I had a 100% discount. Uh-huh. When I stole shit! No, I, I got what you mean for the first time. I bet you grab things all the time. Well, they're big into prosecuting the fullest extent of the here, so... Okay, I'm done looking. Let's go. Okay, it was nice talking to you. Bye now. Uh, see you. Why did I do that? Oh, you did so well, B! I call the cops at shoplifters at my own store. This... What'd you get? Some kind of necklace thing. Nice, nice. Oh, God. Forget it. We're gone. Really? Yeah, we're like out in the open waters now. I feel kind of sick. Let's walk it off. Wow, I completely forgot about the giant fish head. Oh, my God, I loved her. You ever come to the summer days thing here? Yeah, it, I like squirt people. I still have no idea how they did that. One time I saw it knock a guy down. Yeah, every year that would happen and someone would make a fuss. But like, I don't know. You showed up to be squirted by a fish fountain. You know the walkway up, way up there past the upper food court thing up in the atrium? The what? The ceiling, the glass part that points up. Yeah? When I was a kid, I thought that's where God lived. Wow. I don't know. Just remember staring at it when I was a kid. Just eating a burger. Trying to see if I can see God peeking over or something. Looks like they got some weird hanging art up there now. Wanna go? See? Now nah, my knees are killing me from work. This should be good. Wonder what kind of Oh come on! There's no one working the counter. Oh wow. Hello, anyone here? Jeez, this is bleak. This is like something out of a failed state or something. What's that? When you make a country and it doesn't work out. So, like this country? Nah. Hey! 
Jeez, ruins. Let's see what they've got. Honky Tonk, Armageddon, Club of Girl, Rolling Hard at the E at the Rave mix Remixes. Wow, I'd actually listen to that. Just to see what the hell it even means. Cover's got a pickup truck exactly like my uncle's. But this one is on fire and flying in a dragon's face. Uh, <laughs> Adam, I mean, it depends upon where they shoplift from, huh? This one's on fire and flying a dragon's face. Upgrade. <laughs> oh, hey, it's that band. What band? You know, you remember this song? Had that video that people posted like a zillion times? I have no idea what you're talking about. Had that weird horse in it. Oh yeah, I remember I had a weird horse in it. Oh god, yeah, there was horse was all... I remember. Yeah, we have officially remembered that video. We did it! For eating. Yeah, let's eat. Okay. I expect more excitement. Mall food court dinner. Oh, what a feeling. See, that wasn't hard. What did you get? You inhaled it before I got a look. Pierog pierogi burger from Smeltiburg. Ah, that's just a big pile of carbs and meat, huh? Isn't that what we're after? Bones, too. I don't want bones in my burger. What? Remember when Kathy Domenko pulled out Cindy Clark's nose ring here? You know what that was about, right? Wasn't Kathy pregnant with, what was his name, football guy Ron Boonstra? I didn't know you were new about that. Well, I mean, that was the first football game of our senior year. And Ron ran up to the sidelines and yelled at the stands, My first touchdowns for my beautiful firstborn and his mommy, Kathy Domenko. That's something. Kathy was in marching band, and she was crying, I think. And then he dumped her for Cindy like a week later. Oh, yeah. See, that's the part I know about. That's the whole what set off the whole nose ring situation. I wonder what Ron's doing. No, last year he flipped his ATV, and his medical bills were really high. So his parents basically had to bail him out. Yeah, that'll happen. And he got to talk to Kathy again, and, well, now they're married. Worked out for Ron, I guess. You know what the worst part of this story is? Cindy have something ripping out, ripped out of her face? At the time, I was like... God moves things around in the strangest way to bring two people together. Yeah, I don't know if I even believe in God. Same, really. Thinking about this place, the fountain, and the God walkway and stuff, not knowing how something worked used to seem like magic. Now not knowing means it might be wrong, going wrong and I may not be able to fix it. Help knowing someone else was at the controls, you know? Now I'm just tired all the time from the shop. Yeah, when I was at school, yeah. I don't even want to talk about it. What happened, anyway? You want to run around in the mall some more? There's not really much else to run around. We can check out the weird bad art upstairs. I want to touch it. Please don't. I want to run! You run. I'm going to sit here. I'm tired and sad now. Suit yourself. Yeah, jumping on top of a mobile doesn't seem like a good idea. Oh, wow. Is this...? <laughs> Fantastic! Oh, hey. Oh my god. Holy crap. Huh. 
<laughs> ah, May, I know that's you. How are you doing that? <laughs> Stop, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Oh, uh, somebody's gonna call the cops! <laughs> Beatrice Santello! <laughs> oh, don't give us our, our names! Beatrice Jones! Oh, wow, is that you, God? Yes, it is I, God Stevenson. I didn't know you had a last name. Silence, mortal. Through my fish monster, I have lain waste to your kind. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty magical. Silence! I shan't say it again. You and your good and noble companions shall get ice cream on the way home. <laughs> yeah, we should probably get out of here. Before you're arrested. <laughs> the cops shall be confused and stuff and beat each other up, for I am God and I hate the cops. Okay, get down here. Have a good one, mortal. Because it's not sticking it to the man. The man isn't going to lose anything here, but she will get in a lot of trouble. She's just a cog in a much bigger machine, huh? Sure, whatever. Return that shit. Okay, okay, I'm going. Hi. Hello. You're back. Yeah, we stole some shit. Here's that shit. We don't want you to get in trouble with your boss. It's not your fault the world is like it is. What? You stole this? You're just a cog in a much bigger machine. To blame you would be like blaming a hole inside of a thing. So you're returning stolen merchandise. One day, folks like you are going to be able to overthrow the whole thing. What whole thing? The whole thing. We're leaving. Stay strong, you beautiful dreamer. You have nothing to lose but your chains! What? Ah, oh, this place used to be something. I mean, it's still something. Nah, no, just a big, mostly empty thing. And a big, mostly empty parking lot. Well, you work with what you have. Let's never come here again. Don't have to convince me. I only came here because you wanted to. Well, Fort Lucene used to be something. Now Fort Lucene's over. Let's go. Let it die in peace. Let it die. I want to drive on the way home. No. Sup, Dad? Heard you had a wild time last night. Well, I didn't drink. Works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. Ah, oh, hold on. Let me write that down. It's complicated, I know. What'd you do tonight? Went out with B. You have a good time? Yeah, she's kind of, I don't know. Like, she's older. Like, much older. And kind of sad? Well, she's been through a lot. Yeah. Hey, Dad, would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? Been an excellent daughter. That doesn't count. And did you watch some TV with me? Yeah, for a little bit. Hold up. I'm watching Garbo and Malloy. Nice! Welcome back, folks. Hell of a show tonight. Say, Malloy. Yes, Garbo? Ever get the feeling the disaster's right around the corner? Sure do, right before we start the show every night. You superstitious, Garbo? Not anymore. What happened? I've broken every mirror I've ever owned, and now I'm lucky enough to never have to look at this mug. Yeah, but what about the rest of us? Huh? That's a whopper. Coming up next, Garbo and I join a cult. Hey, cool, mall times. Pretty cool mall times, yeah. Hope we didn't make too much of a mess with the fountain. Who's we? I was merely sitting there when I was assaulted with mall water. I will not rest until that fountain is brought to justice. 
tell the world my story. They must know. I'm going to sleep. Hope the nightmares aren't too horrible. It is a trauma I shall bear forever. Hey, dude, what'd you do tonight? Nothing much. Stole something for Angus. Surprise. Wow, what is it? Hold on for a sec. Oh, crap, I gotta go. Talk to you later. Okay, weirdo. Away message. Born to lose. Country trash proud. Drummer escape destroy. Escape to create. Bound for glory. Techonomy today. Economist Pete Corgley. Job growth robust in low wage sectors. So that's kind of a wash, I guess. time. Uh... Save and quit to title. Yes. I think that's a good topping place for now. I'm going to go ahead and get something to eat because I am very hungry. Uh, thanks everybody for watching. Um, stay safe. Stay healthy. Um, and uh, remember to give yourself a hug. All right, talk to you later. Uh, I will be back tomorrow.